My name is Skip Kendall. I'm working on the IRMA project, which stands for Improved Records Management Administration. The general record schedule is um, a guide to um, records commonly found around the university, like financial records and human resources records and all sorts of administrative things. The university record is very broadly defined um, as anything, regardless of format um, that you create or receive in the course of your work at Harvard. Emails that we get are covered in there, anything you get in paper, things you send out to people, um, all the records that create, get created in the business of running a university. The general record schedule started back in 1997, um, was originally published in paper form in a fancy green book, has evolved over time, eventually made it onto the web, and has been through several incarnations in the web. Course records are an example of one kind of record that we might see with the general record schedule. I um, mean, it gives us what we call a retention plan, which tells us how, how long we want to keep it. In this case, it's archives review after five years for a certain number of these records. We may want them, we may not. As it initially moved from paper to the web, it was a very faithful reproduction of paper on the web, which is, of course, not really the optimal way to create a website. We conducted five different focus group sessions to talk to people and find out what they were interested in. We also did an online survey of people, uh, of, of a bro much broader number of people, to just to get some baseline information on what people were interested in and what problems they currently have with the general record schedule. People wanted more personalization. They wanted to be able to identify um, parts of the general record schedule that were particularly relevant to them um, and be able to come back to it later and just find that stuff um, without having to look through everything else first. We have a pretty good idea of what we want, want it to look like. It's going to help people find what they need a lot faster on our website.